641 right now, an update to something nearly 30 years in the making. The entire Truman Parkway is almost done. Many living near the construction zone cannot wait until it's open. WJCL's Rob Macko talked with neighbors about all of the construction. The fifth and final phase of the Truman is being done near the Holland Park neighborhood. Neighbors will have to change their ways when it's done, but many of them say that's okay. Contractors are wrapping up work on phase five of the Truman Parkway. They've been working on the final phase of the project since April 2010. The Department of Transportation is planning a big ceremony for Friday, February 28th. The parkway is expected to open to traffic during the first week of March. The Holland Park neighborhood sits behind these pines off White Bluff Road, and it borders the work zone. During construction, neighbors had to deal with more traffic on Holland Drive, also noise from construction vehicles, and dirt and dust from the construction work zone. So they say they are happy and relieved that this project is almost over with. Longtime neighbor Joan Moses says the parkway will make it easier to get around. Fast and easy to get downtown, fast and easy to get to the landings where I go quite often. The DOT has cut off the neighborhood's direct access to Abercorn Street. Neighbors now must exit onto White Bluff. But to make up for it, the DOT put in a new access road from White Bluff to Abercorn. I missed the Abercorn exit going to Home Depot and stuff, but it, the new road that they put in by the church is, is, is quite adequate. Tara Gerges says the construction hasn't been that bad for her or her dog, Bella. She's happy they cut off the neighborhood's access to Abercorn. It will mean less through traffic on Holland Drive. We had all the traffic going down through our backyard. And it was really noisy, so I actually enjoy it now. So there's no crazy motorcycles, um, ambulances don't fly down there, um, cop cars, so it's actually really nice. Robin Jackson just moved into the neighborhood. She says the parkway will make her life more convenient, and she's looking forward to it. I surely am. I am really looking forward to it because of the simple fact it'll make my destinations easier to get to. Crews also put up this sound wall. It's quiet right now. Neighbors just hope it stays that way once the parkway opens. The contractor must have the parkway open by March 11th. They will be fined if it's not open on time. So it's a pretty safe bet that by early March you'll be able to take the parkway from Abercorn to downtown. Rob Macko, WJCL News, working for you.